You're watching McKinney Vision online on air. Landfills aren't typically the source of good news, but over the years, engineers and scientists discovered that they produce a type of methane gas that can be converted into energy. It's called biogas, and it comes from the decomposition of organic materials. This technology is being used right here in McKinney to help power facilities for Raytheon, the city's largest employer. What happens is there, there's methane gas being generated from the decomposition of the materials in the landfill. So wells are built or dug in the landfill. That gas is then piped into a purifying device so that the methane gas can be pure and then it runs uh, 20 cylinder Caterpillar engines to generate electricity. Uh, we're gonna use about uh, 24,000 megawatt hours that this facility will generate. It is good for the environment in that if we weren't using this methane to generate electricity, it would just be going up into the atmosphere, carbon dioxide and methane. So it needs to be burned off. If you drive by a landfill, you frequently see a big plume. Well, it's being burned off now and turned into energy. That energy isn't being generated by carbon products. So you get a, you get a double whammy. Tubes collect the biogas and then pumps suck the gas into a separator and then it's treated to run huge engines that create the electricity. Now this gas would just dissipate in the air without the process and be lost. Raytheon estimates that this process will cut 20% of its greenhouse gas in five years. We're able to take aggressive steps. I think we have an attitude of it can get done. And that's very important. And being here in McKinney and Raytheon working together and with Montauk and our other partners, we got it done. The business community in McKinney has a history of sustainable practices. Raytheon's commitment to biogas proves that conserving our natural resources can also be good for the pocketbook. And that's just smart business practices. Carl Shookman, McKinney Vision.